I remember as, as a child growing up in Sunderland, we were never destined for academia and universities. I never even knew what a university was. For us, it was the building sites, the military, or the shipyards. And I ended up in building sites for actually for 25 years. I always had this deep sense that this wasn't really for me. I didn't really know what that meant. I just knew something wasn't right, something was missing. I'd always had a love and a fascination for astronomy. Ever since I was a small child, it had gripped me. Every part of it was fascinating. The universe is a, an awe-inspiring environment for anybody who wants to think about reality and think about themselves. The further we look out in space, the further we're looking back in time. And I think that's the amazing property of the universe that really hooks me in. Actually seeing the past unfold before our eyes on a cosmological scale. Light is the undisputed messenger of the universe. But to really appreciate the faintest light, we must have dark skies. The darkest skies on planet Earth can be found where we have really low humidity, no light pollution, and we have altitude. From locations like these, humanity can reach out into the cosmos and search for the next great discovery.